Hi, please look at these uh, amazing uh, images and the GFG gun. This is uh, one of the original photo. You can see how sharp is the faces after the GFG gun. Here you can see the comparison between the two images. Another example. And now we will see another image. This is the original uh, image. And you can uh, watch now the new image after the GFG gun and you can compare both faces before and the after. Now we will see the, the, the whole process. First of all we should uh, uh, download the, the GFG gun uh, library by using the, the git clone. And next uh, we are going to uh, create a, a conda environment. Please notice that this is Python 3.9. We will activate. Of course, I will leave in the video description uh, a text file with all the, the process step by step. Next, we will see what is the CUDA version of the GPU card. You can see that uh, my CUDA version is uh, 11, so we will download the, the relevant uh, Torch version. Please look, I'm choosing the, the CUDA 11 and I will uh, copy the installation uh, command. Let's wait for the process to end. Now we will start uh, to pip install several uh, Python libraries. First one is the OpenCV. And uh, please watch carefully for all the other uh, Python libraries. As I said, I will leave uh, in the video description uh, a text file with all the, the process. So you can uh, follow it, do it by your own and follow it uh, using this uh, video. So we finished to install all the Python um, libraries. Now we should run the, this library setup. It's a very short process. And the next step before uh, running the, the, the process, we will download the, the model uh, weights. We'll copy, copy it from the GitHub, uh, GitHub page. Okay, we should wait until the, the download will uh, finish. Please look, the, the model will be stored in this directory.
So you can see that uh, the model is uh, download and store in this uh, directory. Now we will uh, copy some uh, images. This is the, the free images. This is the first one. You can see the uh, second one, which is a very old one, and this is the, the third one. We will uh, copy these three images to, uh, to the home directory. We will uh, create a new folder, call it uh, media, and we will copy the images into this uh, folder. Now we will run the, the model process that uh, enhance the, the images, the face images. This is the, the first command, inference uh, gfgvan.pi, uh, upscale2. Test pass is our original images, it's on the media directory. And save root is, will be, the outcome will be stored in the results, uh, which is a, a new a new folder with the enhanced uh, images. We will wait until the process will be finished. It's a very short process. Please watch that some of the images is a very short one and the other one can be a little, uh, a little bit more, but basically it's a very short process. Okay, it will be finished uh, soon. And now we will uh, watch on the result uh, folder to see the, the outcome. One more minute, yes, now it's finished. Okay. Please watch that we have several folders in the in the result uh, folder, first one is the compare folder that we can compare the faces before and after the process. This is the first one, this is the second one, this is the third one, not a, a good outcome. You can see that uh, it's a little bit uh, artificial and the last one, it's a very good, uh, good outcome. And the restore images, this has the, let's say, the final uh, touch. This is basically, basically the, the, the outcome of the model. I will compare it uh, to the original, which is in the media folder. And you can uh, watch uh, uh, each image one next to each other. And you can see the, the amazing uh, touch of this uh, GFG gun uh, Python li library. And that's all. Thank you. You are most welcome to share this video and subscribe to my channel.